20 years ago they were seen as a bunch of crazy inventors. Now these Dutch designers say they are ready to fly. If you come to a place where you want to take off, it takes you about two minutes to change it to flight mode. What long seemed a futuristic idea is looking pretty real on this Dutch road. So far this flying car is only allowed to drive. The company hopes to get permission from the European Aviation Safety Agency as early as next year. Scientists long try to figure out how to make a car fly or a plane drive. We have to be able to fold rotors, propellers, tails into a shape where you can take it on the road. And that's very challenging especially because it has to be light. So all these technologies are incorporated in our design and that's why we can build a flying car now, which we couldn't 10 or 15 years ago. Although tens of companies worldwide are developing innovative modes of transportation, this company claims theirs is the first flying car that will become a reality. Dutch taxi companies have ordered three. It still feels like I'm playing a part in a science fiction movie. And it's hard to imagine that I could soon fly away with this car, at least if I would have the money to buy it. Unfortunately, the company wants details kept secret and were not allowed to film this car in action. And skeptics don't believe that we'll soon see a sky full of flying cars. Yeah, flying DeLorean car back to the future. But this is not technically feasible. Uh, this is fantasy. This is pure fantasy. Although PAL-V could soon be technically feasible, aviation expert Joris Melker does not see it as a new mode of transportation. This is a toy for very rich boys, you could, uh, could say. And there may be some, some niche uh, places where you can use this. Special forces, uh, emergency aid. Uh, so there may be some niche uh, products uh, for that. But, but of not course, for you and me? No, I guess I would have to ask for a salary raise first. Uh. Okay, the runway is clear. We have no wind. You are a go for landing. Instructors say it takes 45 hours to learn to fly the PAL-V, which is based on a gyroplane, a mix between a helicopter and a plane. Tommy van Rijen is one of those who ordered a half a million euro flying car. It's ultimate freedom for me. So uh, I will use it uh, for business in Italy and I also use it for pleasure. You know, everybody, every, every young boy wants to be James Bond one day and I want, I'm one of them. While for James Bond, the imagination has no boundaries. In real life, customers of the Dutch flying car will have to find an airstrip first before they can take off and land. Step fast in Al Jazeera, Ramsdong Veer.